Hey guys, Rose here with another video for you today. Today we are back in Bell Lab, of course, with a brand new couple of awesome mods that came out uh, last night and obviously today. Uh, this video is coming up obviously late because, well, because of the freaking Brandon tweet that came up earlier today. So, yeah, that kind of threw my whole schedule through a loop. But, anyways, it's finally out. <laughs> video for today's. I want to make a video on this finally here, so here let's hop right into it. So, title, guess what? Title, yeah, it's Minecraft related. So, we're on a Minecraft map, and um, this mod is pretty crazy. As you can see, I already got started. I wanted to have a cool little showcase here and there, but this mod is extremely awesome because this allows you to essentially, well, build pretty much any Minecraft creation you want from a castle to you know a simple shack and it, it's pretty awesome the way this works so the way the modder made it is to where you have to start out with the uh, you have to start out with the uh, get the first get the find the modder which is fizzy hex huge shout out to them for making such a crazy mod what we have to do first is go ahead and select from these four right here and place it down the ground. And then you can essentially start minecrafting from this block and just like that. Like that's insane. Like what? <laughs> like the fact that they have this implemented almost, I would say almost super well. There's just a few little things here and there. A few little minor not really complaints, but uh, things I've discovered, like the fact that the size is wrong. As you can see here, the size is a bit off. Maybe it's right. What do I know? This is just a most likely ported map, but you know, it is what it is. Maybe they did the full research and this is the right size and this is the wrong size. Oh, no. But most Minecraft maps that are ported to Bone Lab have this size instead of that size but that's either here or there but it is extremely awesome the way they permit that so once you do that once you get started your ammo pouch becomes you know the blocks so it's pretty cool um, and the way you change these is you spawn in the other the, the other things that are on top of the the main block that I showed you you spawn these in, you pick them up. I just press trigger just in case, just to activate them. As you can see here, got a glass one. Let's see. Okay, so you don't have to press trigger or anything, you just pick it up and it's there. Just to confirm this. Yeah. 
like that's pretty insane you just pick out one of these pick out a little block and um no essentially start cl climbing or not what i think can be improved upon the system is um instead of having multiple you know guns that you have to pull out have one singular gun that can open up a menu and then obviously with your free hand you can just select the blocks i know this is like super early that's just a suggestion i have suggestion i have which i think would be you know pretty cool pretty poggers i don't know why that's the way it is Anywho, i messed up <laughs> i messed up in my oh, i dropped it too soon <clears throat> Actually, I dropped it too late. So yeah, you gotta get the timing down and everything. You know, you drop it, then you jump, and then there you go. So, I could've just dropped it, but, you know, whatever. But yeah, it works very, very well. Like, it's crazy, you just throw a block, and there it is, just throw a block, and there it is. Like, that's crazy. Build, make full on creations this way. Like, it is truly one of the most satisfying things you can do. Which is just pick that out, go ahead, pick this out, boop, and then boop. <laughs> Look at that. That's crazy. And then they're fully, they're, they're in the environment. You can just, you know pop up the stairs and everything and there you go you're, you're up here like what like, it's crazy that this matter was able to get this implemented so well like just imagine if the update ever freaking comes which it should be in a couple of uh, days if Yeah, it's truly amazing. There's only four types so far, unfortunately. So there's glass, there's grass, there's a little feature about this, and there's sand. So another cool little thing about this is... Go ahead. Oh, wait. Right, you have to first. As you can hear, you can hear the grass block sound, which is pretty cool, but not only that, but look at that. It plays the, the actual sound when you're on top of it, so it doesn't play all the time. It's certain times that it'll play. There you go. It'll play right there. But yeah, that's pretty insane. Like, just imagine if this modder, like, goes, you know, full production with this and you know, makes the full, like, ports every single Minecraft block, which would take an astonishing amount of time. But I'm pretty sure they can do it. Like, imagine they implement, you know, fully functional doors that open and close. They can just spawn in. Redstone, that actually works. The torches, uh, earlier in the video, I showed a torch. It was actually a different, you know, version of the mod. But, like, imagine a crafting table that actually freaking, like, worked. Like, Say for example, I have a crafting table right now, and then you can, you know, you can take the block out of your pocket that you need, and you can just place it down, you know, the exact way it's supposed to go, and then all of a sudden a pickaxe from in this game, or even a Minecraft version, just pops into existence and those blocks disappear. That would be insane. Like, that would actually be a cool little mechanic that they could add. Just an idea, I know this is probably not going to go anywhere. But I'm hoping it will. I'm hoping the modder will see the potential of this and expand upon upon it and add a lot more than what we currently have. So it's crazy though. Man, I can only imagine what it'll be like, you know, <laughs> five years from now when we're looking back on this type of video I make of these early on version of the mods. Like, that's crazy. Maybe that's crazy. But anyways, I'm rambling on about this amazing mod that deserves more, a lot more praise, a lot more props. Cause like, look at that, it's so sad. I, mean, I think another cool mechanic would be, um, obviously, if uh, 
it'll take a lot more work to do this but if, um they made a, a minecraft world where you can actually you know cut down all the trees and all the blocks and everything like you know you take thor's hammer hammer for example you can actually smack against this but it even makes the sound it even makes the sound that's so crazy. Another cool feature about this is the blocks are, act well, not all the blocks, but at least so far the glass block is breakable. So with a force, you can actually break it so you can actually do the. There it is. Which is super cool, which means they could definitely implement that type of uh, mechanic to where you can actually, you know, break the block. And a cool thing I think would be if the block turns back into its regular form before the ammo form before you place it like if it turns into that then you just pick it up add it to your inventory oh hold on add it to your inventory and then obviously but that'll take a lot more a lot more time to develop and make so this is good so far really enjoying this so let's go ahead leave these here for now Let's get into the uh, other mods. I already know I wasted a bunch of time on that. But that mod is truly amazing. I hope more mods like that are added in the near future. But right here, we're going to go ahead and test out this SD. I don't know what this thing is. It's, but um, from the screenshot and video alone, this thing is actually insane. Oh. Hold on. Okay. Got my, got my thing. But yeah, it's uh truly insane. Like what this thing does, like the cool effect it has. Let's go ahead and just spawn in Ford as a test subject. Ford. What up, son? How's it going? It's going great, Ford. Your day is about to be a little bit less great, but you go ahead and press the menu button. Nice little cards of sound and this is a cool hyper beam of death. I don't know why it despawns like that. Another little thing about that is a um, little complaint I have it is uh, it's called the SCP Michael and why they call it an SD <laughs> right? I don't know. Their little complaint is the way it spawns in. Why does it spawn back there? <laughs> it's kind of weird. I don't know, maybe it's a first person mod or something, or maybe the thing got broken up in some way. I don't know, but it is super cool to um, just fire this death cannon. Wow. That's so cool. I just wish it didn't despawn. But yeah, that's uh that's that mod. Up next we are gonna go ahead and uh hold on. We're gonna go ahead and uh cover You know what it is. You know what time it is. It's time to cover the God of War freaking pack. Now I have to say, this is by um Drax and uh there's another mod. I keep forgetting their name. I always forget their name. But yeah, this mod is pretty cool. Jackson Dolantrum, 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 Dolantrum. But uh, yeah, these are like partners in crime. They be making all types of cool mods and whatnot, Call of Duty mods and whatnot together. So they've been making a lot of cool mods lately, and um, <laughs> this is definitely one of their, uh, definitely one of their top, because like. Like, look at the model. Like, it's crazy. Like, this is just Kratos. You can even be freaking four. Like, look at the detail on this thing. I'm Big Man Thor. Like, that's crazy. They even, they even have, like, Kratos' small little accent going around. That's funny. Like, they even fully got the very, very, very detailed versions of the God of War weapons. 
Like, look at that. It's so sick. Yeah, that's so cool. Oh, dang, that's so strong. Thor is. Oh, I did it. <laughs> Anyways, unfortunately, it does not return. None of them have a return function. So it can't do this for me. <laughs> oh, man. Such a missed opportunity. You can do the God of War thing scene where they collide <laughs> like oh hold on oh <laughs> i got it look at that <laughs> look at that so sick <laughs> there it is all right uh, another little thing here um for drax for some reason when you smack these around too much, I don't know if it's gone up for you guys, but the sound cuts out completely and I have to do that to get the sound back. So if you just hit way too many times, the sound just goes away. Uh, I have to find like something to actually hit. I don't know, maybe it's... There it goes, see? I don't know if it cut out for you guys or not, but the sound goes and everything, and it's a little bug I found. So, you know, there's that, but these mods are insane. Let's go ahead and get another freaking Ford. Oh, I clicked on the wrong thing. Let's go ahead and get another freaking Ford to illustrate this with. Like how giant I am compared. Going to enjoy using this in his videos. Like, hey. you're fucking <laughs> I'm gonna put like a, put like a behemoth. But yeah, Drax did do one super cool thing with the hammer actually, and it's actually like super strong. I don't know if it's heavy or anything, but yeah, okay, it's it, it's it's heavy, just like the. Uh, other one from the other modern that the other modern <laughs> Oh yeah, I've been loved if not just went ahead, got permission from the other modern to add the return function to both of these. Maybe make it a little bit more custom, like add custom sounds to it and everything to make it more unique and break it apart. And make it different from kind of you know the other Thor's hammer mod. Like it would be so cool. You throw it, and then you can like actually snap. <laughs> like you would have to maybe press like both the trigger and menu button, and then release. Just to, uh, it will activate the return function. But that's just an idea I have. Let's go ahead and. I think, uh, I think the door's a little bit too strong. Oh, the sound went out again. Well, let me fix the sound. Really an awesome freaking mod. I mean, look at that. <laughs> oh, he's actually dead. Oops. Did 
that go? Uh, where did... Where did the hammer go? Where did the hammer go? Guys, where'd the, where'd the hammer go? Hello? There you are. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, so that's gonna do it for today's video, guys. Hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and like, comment down below. If you'd like to see me do, you know, more videos of it in the near future. And as always, remember to support me down on Patreon. Wanna keep this channel alive, keep it going. And uh, yeah, as always, we're gonna take a step back into that life, guys. I'll see you all in the next one. Alright. Oh, peace.